Hello everyone, BlizzCon is here. This is day two of BlizzCon actually, and we're gonna go and we are going to walk around the Nimmer Halls. We're gonna check out the Warcraft stuff. These look super sick. I'm lavved up, which is cool. Everything is here. They have like Season of Discovery. They have retail stuff all around here. They have cinematics playing all day. They got the music. You can see Jaina over there too. Let's walk around this way and let's start checking everything out. Look at this uh, Jaina statue. This Jaina statue is unreal. It looks almost human. It's like, look at her face. It's freaking wild. But yeah, they got, they got all kinds of crazy stuff here. People are, are this, is, this is like the place. This is the, this is the place where like everybody's at. This BlizzCon is basically like a straight up like a Warcraft BlizzCon, it's nuts. You got cinematics playing all day. People are here, you got this like cool little, uh, you got like a dining hall area. You know what this reminds me of? This is like in Karazhan, and in Moreau's room. You got the dining area, people just sit here. They're watching like uh, different cinematics and stuff, are playing all day. And also I think they restream some of the stuff. Like they, like, that if you can't make it into the main hall, they'll, uh, they'll restream some stuff, which is pretty cool. So, they got everything, man. I think on this side they have all the different retail stuff set up. People can go and they can demo like the new retail content. I think there's like 10.2 stuff, I'm pretty sure. And then of course, my personal, my area. The classic side, it's on that side. So, yeah, we got oh classic stuff. Hey, the how's it going? Right. What's okay. up, dude? What's up, man? Hey. Oh, look, they got the big sword. Look at this. But yeah, huge line of people all the way over there taking pictures. But yeah, this sword, man, they got the sword and sell this from retail. Oh, isn't that amazing? Actually amazing. And they're like, that sword, the sword, that sword. But yeah. Okay, let's, uh, we'll move through this way. But man, the spectacle of BlizzCon, there's absolutely nothing like it, dude. There's actually nothing like it at all. The spectacle is insane. But I wonder, how do they do this? Are these projectors? Yeah, oh, this is a projector. Yeah, it's a projector on this side, but it's so bright. Pretty dope. Yeah, it's so bright that you can see through it. That's sick, dude. Yeah, we didn't really get to walk the floor at all yesterday because we were so busy. There were so many different announcements. There were so many different, uh, I mean, events that I was doing. Like, I, I actually streamed. I got to play Season of Discovery yesterday with some of the devs, which was great. And then uh, I, was, uh, I was on the panels here. I was at the panels, excuse me. Uh, but yeah, you got people playing here. That's where I was set up playing. I think some of the retail guys, I saw Absturge here earlier. Dude, they got a big crowd. They got a big old crowd here. Is this the, uh, yeah, this is the classic area. The classic demo area. Oh, they got demo surveys for people, like if you played it. Human, it's human, of course, very good. Where's the Paladin? There needs to be a, there needs to be a Paladin one. But I love that, I love how they have all the different, like Dark Iron Dwarf, Shaman, Rogue, Blood Elf. They have all the different crests. It's sick. Dude, you guys look incredible. How long did it take you guys to, to do this? Five months, 300 hours each of us. Oh my gosh. Are, are you guys doing the contest later? Yeah. Nice, well good luck. You guys look incredible. Thank you. Yeah, hell yeah, I'll see you guys. But yeah, this is all the like classic demo stations. I wonder if I can just cut through. I wanna, I wanna like jump over. Here, chat. Here, let's do this. I wanna jump over and I just wanna go talk to people and just see, I just ask them what they think. Let's see, just see what people say. Hey, how's it going? How are you? Can I jump through and just talk to people who are playing? Stick your true badge on and go in. Okay, cool. Sick. Yeah, dude, Blizzard has been, uh, oh, there you are. <laughs> there you go, Chad. Yeah, dude, Blizzard, Blizzard has been, uh, just, uh, like, progressively more and more, like, willing to work with the content creators and stuff, which is, which is cool to see because, I mean, you see it happening with a lot of the other different companies, a lot of the other different devs, that the, uh, it's, it's, it's good for everybody to, to work together and give people access to stuff and like, hey, get to show this, get to do that. So that's cool. And it opens the door for more feedback. He's like, yo, how's it going, dude? How are you? How's it going? I'm, I'm good, I'm good. How about you? No, doing great, doing great. Yeah, yeah. so far? Yeah, it's been sick, so. Well, what do you think? I, I, I. Why did you get to watch your stream yesterday? I was like, it was disgusting. I was doing like double everybody else's damage. Oh, so you're like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was great. No, I'm, uh, I wanted to go through and, uh, they said I can cut through it, and, and I was just gonna talk to people in, in line, and they're not in line but playing. And I want to—I just asked them like, "Hey, what do you think?" Okay. It might be funny. I show up and people are like, "Wait, what?" <laughs> I guess. Yeah. What'd you guys think? Good. 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 That was good. Yeah, I'm having fun. Sick. Okay. Cool. Nice. Nice scene, man. Yeah. See you guys. You gotta give Wake a hug for me. Okay? Oh, I—I I always do. 
I think it's interesting they did this with BFD. I actually would have liked to see them do it with another dungeon, personally, because I almost think like BFD is like a wet molten core. I kind of wish they had done like Shadowfang Keep or something, but it's still cool. It's fun to like check everything out. But what the heck, they're trading. Dude, this sick, man. Oh, they have voice chat. Oh, they're using the in-game voice, that's funny. The in-game voice is actually not bad. Dude, I was doing, all, remember whenever I did All Track Valley? I was doing AVs and Burning Crusade on the voice, and it was, just, it was like just memes. It was so good, the in-game voice. With randoms, min-maxing on demo server, true. No, the in-game voice is sick. It's so funny, man, isn't this crazy? Like, just looking through and just seeing all these people playing WoW and, and Classic and Season Discovery and, I, like I said, I think, I think I'm worried that they might be going a little bit overboard. That's my personal thought. I'm excited about the potential, but it's almost a little bit too much. Yeah, it's almost a little bit too much. Yo, what do you think so far? Nice to see you. Yeah, man. How do you, how do you, what do you think so far? Oh, nice, you're playing a rat. Oh, you died. Yeah. Oh, no, what happened? I don't know, you showed up and cursed me. I don't know. <laughs> the camera died, too. Yeah, my bad. I cursed you, yeah. Have you played this yet? Yeah, yeah, I played earlier. I, I, uh, I put a video on my YouTube channel. You like red a lot more now in this, don't you? It's it's okay. It's uh, I I think they need to tweak it a little bit. I was like oh I was like overpowered. I was doing double everybody else damage. Yeah, man. I had to beat you in person. Yeah, of course, dude. I'll be a fun. Dude, I literally I showed up and the guy dies. Are you kidding me? That's, I'm like I'm like a curse. I think they're going overboard, but they basically all but have said that this is like it's the classic plus beta basically. Hey, how's it going? What's up, guys? Yeah, I'll be a fun. Yeah, it's it's all but. The classic plus beta, like they didn't, they don't, they didn't call it that, but that's what this is. I think we're probably gonna get classic plus sometime next year. I expect, an, I, I expect this to be like, hey, let's throw everything at the wall, see what happens. Okay, you throw everything at the wall, see what happens, and then uh, from there, okay, people like this, they don't like this, they like that, they don't like that. Maybe we need to re-implement this another way. Um, like I think the rune system can be cool, but I think it might be too much. It needs to feel like vanilla. And they said that in the panel. They said they want to keep it to the spirit of vanilla. They want to keep the class fantasy. And I think this, this might be a little bit moving too far this way. And I think they need to reel it back. But this is a, it's a beta. It's, this is a demo. And I think Season of Discovery is a beta. That's the only way I'm looking at it. Hey, how's it going? Hey, what's going what's on? What's up, bro? man? How are you? How are you? How, how do you like it so far? Uh, we just started. Oh, really? This new rune stuff is pretty fucking cool. I, I think, like, I think it's fun. I'm, I'm, uh, I hope it's not going too far, but, like, just seeing the potential is, like, insane. Like, the priest stuff is, is, like, I saw the priest stuff yesterday in the panel, and it was, like, dude, they can do everything. They're going to be nuts. Honestly, unfortunately, Blizzard has a real habit of shitting the bed as far as, <laughs> uh, like, yeah. introducing stuff. Because yeah. when they introduced it, I was like, this sounds really stupid. That's, that's what I thought, too. But I, then when I did the deep dive, I was like, oh, okay. Oh, okay, this yeah, yeah there's something there. So, oh, yeah. But, yeah, I've been, I've been playing a Shadow Priest at the moment. I got a 45 on Classic. Yeah, yeah. And I put my boys over here, so. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah, but honestly, it's been pretty cool. Well, oh, cool. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, so okay, well, I'll be a fun dude. Hey, good stuff to buy. Yeah, man, we'll see ya. Oh, no! <laughs> no, 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 please. <laughs> Why do you hit so hard? I'm four levels higher than you. You hit so hard. What the heck? You guys look great. I love the, I love the, the villager on top. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at the statue, dude. The spectacle of BlizzCon is just absolutely incredible, man. It's, it, it really is something else. Okay. So we're going to check out the Warcraft Tavern. So this is cool. This whole hall, like we said earlier, they have Warcraft stuff everywhere, right? Warcraft stuff is everywhere. You got the statues, you got the demo stations for, for retail, for classic, you got the streaming stations, and then on this side, you have the tavern, right? Here in the tavern, what you have is the Hearthstone. This is, I mean, this is the Hearthstone area. There's Warcraft Rumble on the other side, which we'll check out too. But Hearthstone is here, we gotta find a way in. I think entrance is on the other side. Let's go over there. Okay, so yeah, this is basically like the Hearthstone area. But this is, I think, one of the coolest areas in like, in all of BlizzCon. The last couple of times I came too, years ago, four or five years ago. I just feel like this is like an upgraded Loot Goblin set. They got the uh, Hearthstone, like the Badlands stuff that was just announced. There's these nice wooden benches, like it's like a real tavern style. Super cool. I love, I love the RP stuff, man. I love the RP stuff. And this is a, this is a bar. 
They have a they have a bar set up here. Do they have food too? I think they have food. Oh, they have popcorn. Tables, no way. Yes, it, dude, tables are sick. I love tables, man. Tables are badass, dude. Look at this. Look at the curvature. Ah, uh, that was cool, huh? Wanna see? I'll do it again. I'll do it again. Watch. Ready? Ready? Dude, the Defiance Pillagers, they were red earlier and they changed their light to green so they're not aggro anymore. That's hilarious. That's so funny. Dude, look at this fire. This is a real fire. Wait, this is cozy? This is super cozy. I got the, uh, the bison. Oh, man. It's toasty. Like it looks, it looks like those are actual windows, but they're just hanging from the ceiling. Doesn't that look cool? Yeah, look at that. Isn't that wild? By the way, Chad, if you guys are new here, turn on your notifications for the channel. If you want to know whenever I'm live, you want to see what I'm doing, turn on the notifications. You can also download on Google Chrome and Firefox. There's an, there's an add-on, there's an extension. s updates. YouTube, Instagram, Discord, Reddit, everything's s -Fan. Okay, so next, we played this yesterday. Let's go to Warcraft Rumble. Let's check Warcraft Rumble out. I think these are cool. Good quality. What do you think these trees are made out of? Look at the flowers. Some kind of foam. Cool. Yeah, the Warcraft Rumble area is very like, very cartoony. Very like, like they made it look like kind of the same aesthetic of the game. Like the art style is really cool. Hi. Hey, how's it going? You want this shirt? Uh, no, I'm good. I'm good. Thanks. Have right. a good day. Right, we'll see ya. Did we see? Oh, we didn't see the Darkmoon Fair. Let's go to the Darkmoon Fair. Look at this Varian Wren, dude. This looks amazing. Absolutely incredible. Hey. What's your opinion of Paladins and the new classic? They're overpowered. Overpowered? Way strong. But they're always overpowered. They're always overpowered. So it's the same? Thing. It's the same. <laughs> All right. Guys, we're here at the Dark Moon Fair. The real Dark Moon Fair, chat. They do this at BlizzCon. They have a bunch of fair games and stuff going on here. This is like a super hype, exciting part of BlizzCon. Like, if you know the Dark Moon Fair in WoW, uh, I mean, it's it's once a month it comes. What is it? The first, is it the first Sunday, the first Monday of every month? Something like that. I can't, I can't even remember right now. One week a month, the Dark Moon Fair shows up, and there's like a whole bunch of different like games and like little mini stuff you can do. It's not so fleshed out in Classic WoW, but in retail, it's nuts. Like it's its own zone. It's a portal and it's its own instance area, and they have all kinds of stuff. So they got a bunch of different like pins and badges that you can win here. I guess doing games and oh my gosh, look at these guys' collections. This is crazy. What's up, man? Hey. Yeah, do it. Was this yours? Those are mine. Uh oh, let's show them. Take videos of everything. Yeah, look at this. This pin collection is nuts. They didn't ask them to come, did you? No, no. No, oh, he's just dwelling back at home. Yeah, yeah. This is sick. Is it? Yeah. So how many how many pins do you have total? Total? Oh my God. Probably like. How many pins are there? Well, there's like twelve. We <laughs> like, yeah, there's like eight hundred US pins that are like Blizzard, like related licensed pins. Oh my gosh. And we have almost all of them. I'm only missing a set. And oh then my I got gosh. every Blizzard pin that's been made. That's wild. I got employee pins. Really? I got stuff that, I, I have I have a set of pins that I'm the only one outside Blizzard HQ that has them. Wait, how, so how, how did you get that? I found a guy. I found a guy who was willing to sell them. He, was, he used to be on the team. And uh, we talked, I traded him for a little bit of cash, and now I have him. Hell yeah. I didn't even know what I had for the longest time, so I started talking to the other guys. Wow, that's sick, man. Isn't that amazing? That's absolutely insane. So you're missing all but like one set, so you have like almost 800 pins. Oh, easily. Yeah. Yeah, wow. Yeah, plus all the stuff for plus the extra stuff. Plus all this? Wow, this is amazing. Yeah, flip through, look at yeah. yeah, they're good. Oh my gosh, you have like everything. How, dude, this is probably gonna be so heavy. Oh my gosh. You got yeah, StarCraft. You put, you put all three of these in your backpack and carry it around on your back. It's oh, dude. You guys are freaking... <laughs> you guys get your cardio in, that's for sure. That's what we do, man. Like, I walked into BlizzCon and I stood in this spot all day yesterday. Right? Yeah. And I did the same thing today. Hell yeah. That's my BlizzCon, man. You're helping nice. Me and I know well, dude, that's amazing, man. I mean, that's, that's one of the things about BlizzCon is like, the community aspect of it is, is just like nuts because yeah. people come like every year or like, yeah. I mean, in this case, not for four years, but like people always show up and there's just, everybody has a different experience, whether it's like there's, there's community things that have happened over time like this 
or like people meeting up with like their guilds and wow or like, just, like it's all kinds of stuff that's what's so cool to me it's a very different vibe so i love seeing like this and seeing people hang out and yeah. do everything that's so hell yeah all day. this is the whole reason we come to blizzcon yeah that's it's so sick trade. oh it's like a vending machine at cc's pizza there you go and you put the thing in and then you and you get the right ones oh this is the gamba it's it's gamba Pin trading? Oh, this is, there's some more pin trading here. So it looks like that's a lot of what the Dark Moon Fair is. It's like, uh, they have like a lot of pin trading and stuff. Hey, how's it going? Good. Hey, how's it going? What else do they got? Wait, do they have like food and stuff here? I didn't even see this area. They got food here. And there's no lines because nobody knows about it. We're gonna go, we're gonna go there in a little bit. Let's take a look inside the toy shop. Oh, oh. yo. That's crazy. These backpacks? Oh, no, this is a Funko Pop and Loungefly bag bundle. Oh, it is. Diva Funko Pop and Loungefly bag. Wait, this bag is kind of sick, though. Whoa. Hold up. Soulstone Power Bank. Ages 14 plus, not a toy. I'm going to be honest. If this didn't say Diablo on it and Power Bank, I, thought, I would think this is ages 18 plus. This is, <laughs> this is, this is questionable. Hey, how's it going? I'm so proud of you, man. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. I just like, Thanks. Everyone yeah. at the office was tuned in. Really? On Tuesday. Hell like, yeah. I mean, the whole place came to a halt. Oh, really? It was so awesome, dude. That's awesome. I'm, I'm so glad, man. I'm, I'm I, like, uh, that, how that whole thing went, I, I'm like so proud of it. Chad, this is Kyvax. What's your exact like title now? Community manager. It's still, okay, it's, 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 because I don't know, because I feel like everybody, like, their titles all got like swept around and whatever, like, all of them. So I'm like, I don't know what people's titles are. But yeah, Kyvax is community manager for a while, and we've known each other like five years now. Yeah. 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 Ever since you returned <laughs> just before Classic. Yeah. Which I can't believe it's been that long. I know, like, right? It just seems like maybe a year ago, but it was 2019. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's like a COVID, like, like, like fast forwarded, like yeah. the last like three years. So, yeah. I gotta say again, you did such a great job. With yeah. The tournament. I like, people had all kinds of screenshots of you with your green screen, right? <laughs> like, oh, it was just, it was just so yeah. cool to see. No, it's it's fun. Like, I think it was like a really good way to, cause I kind of like had been taking a break for a while, doing like, just everything. So it was like a good way to like, I mean, it's something I was really passionate about, right? Like, I've always wanted to put on something like that and. It just went so well, and, and, and the guys worked so hard on it. I mean, tips alone, like, I, I keep saying this, tips might have put in, like, 100 hours behind the scenes. <laughs> like, I'm already kind of cooking up some ideas for, like, doing something similar in the future. I'm sure I'm not the first one to say, when's the next one? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, who knows? Maybe even something for, like, uh, the, the season of Discovery. I mean, there's a lot of ideas. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Good to see you, man. Yeah, absolutely. It's great seeing you, too, man. Yeah, yeah. It's super great seeing you. Yeah, thanks. It's been great. I think that's it for the Warcraft stuff. So the Warcraft part of BlizzCon was absolutely incredible. I bought some things, right? I got a little StarCraft thing too, you know, classic. But uh, absolutely incredible stuff up here with Warcraft. YouTube, Instagram, Discord, Reddit, Twitch, Twitter, X, Threads, whatever it's called, TikTok, anything it is. Everything is S-Fan TV, so make sure to go like follow, like, subscribe, all that stuff. Leave a comment below, like the video, let me know what you guys think. I'm having a great BlizzCon, so I'm happy I get to share it with you guys. So, hope you guys enjoyed.